Mistissini Cree Nation is located in northern Quebec, a rigorous 17-hour drive northeast of Toronto. This remote Indigenous community has been grappling with hopelessness, leaving a tangible heaviness in the hearts of many. But we were seeing our people such in a devastated uh, situation. Our flags were flying at half mast forever. Uh, there was so much death. Responding to this crisis, Chief Kenny Blacksmith, alongside his wife Louise, organized a solemn assembly, a gathering for prayer and fasting to uplift the Cree people. People are just struggling so much, so we thought we would uh, invite our friends to come and stand with us and pray with us. People from around the world responded to the call and gathered for three days to pray for healing and restoration. Some traveled as far as the UK, Costa Rica, and New Mexico. My name is Holly Kingsbury. I'm from Laguna Pueblo in New Mexico. I came up here with a group of people who um, are intercessors. I am expecting God to just show up and just bring his love, bring his power, that people will know that he is, he is still with them and that his eye is on them. I think it's just been amazing to watch the nations come together to be a voice on the earth, to echo heaven's heart for every nation, every tribe and language for healing. Many indigenous leaders from the region also gathered to express their worship to Creator God through traditional dance and drumming. Inuit elder Louisa released what she calls the breath of God with traditional Inuit throat singing. Prayers in English and Cree cascaded forth, overflowing with thankful hearts for what only Creator God can do. Messianic Jew David Rosen, a longtime friend of Chief Kenny and Louise, traveled from Pennsylvania with his family to stand with the Cree people. He shares what he believes God is doing among them. We've been lifting our hands together in unity, arm in arm, every tribe and tongue, we believe out of this will command a blessing uh, for the land and the people. How has this gathering impacted Chief Kenny and Louise Blacksmith? For our friends that have traveled far, we couldn't have done it. Just being here with us and blessing our people. So thank you so much for, to everyone who came. Chief Kenny believes that from this gathering, his people have found a renewed sense of purpose and encouragement. From this place, many will go back to bring healing to their communities. It's been beyond our expectation. Coming before God and giving Him our love and uh, just our heart. And that's what our people are starting to capture. And I, I saw that the churches were coming together this morning. So different pastors and, and even more people from different communities were coming. And young people were starting to rise up. We, the people, are the arrows of the Lord that would be used mightily for His plan and purposes. Please continue to pray for Mysticini Cree Nation and all Indigenous communities that God will continue to do a great healing inside them so that they will become agents of change for all nations.